Ben, so welcome to uh, another Midweek Encouragement. But you can see today the Midweek Encouragement is going to be a little bit different because you've got three people for the price of one. Uh, so for our Midweek Encouragement today, I'm really delighted that we've got Martha uh, Lloyd with us. Martha, as many of you all know, has just started as our youth worker. Uh, she's also working with Alton College, which is absolutely brilliant, and also with the King's Arms Project. And friends, we're going to find out a little bit about Martha now. And uh, through that, hopefully you'll discover a bit about Martha too. So, Andrew, over to you. I think you've got a question for Martha. Martha, you're going to be joining the ministry team. And when we meet, uh, we drink lots of tea. How do you like yours? Ah, oh, OK. Um, milk, no sugar. Don't mind if it's strong. Bit of a builder's tea. Cool. Good answer, good answer. Tell us a little bit about yourself. So, um, yeah, I'm Martha, I'm 20. I'm from Warsaw in the West Midlands. Um, and I moved down south to Petersfield last year to do an internship um, with the King's Arms, which was a discipleship and leadership course. Um, so that was great. And that's why I'm down in Alton. Um, but more about me, I <laughs> I love youth work, I love God, um, my favourite colour is yellow, and yeah, that's me. <laughs> yeah, great, thank you very much. Gordon? I've got a really important question. Okay. This is really key, right, okay. Is it cream or jam? Cream before jam first, or is it jam before cream first? I'm going to say cream, then jam. Cream, then jam. Yeah. Cool. So is that Dorset or Cornwall, Gordon? That's Cornwall. That's Cornwall, so that's cool. And it's Devon, <laughs> not, not Dorset. It's Devon. Devon. It's Devon, and, Devon, Devon and Cornwall, mate. <laughs> but that's the right answer. That's how I take it. So that's cool. Uh, got, come on, we're back with a sensible question. Or, Andrew, you put, or you put jam on one side and cream on the other and just put them together. <laughs> Fantastic. Could do that, I suppose. Could do that. Uh, Martha, what excites you about being a youth and families worker? Um, I am a people person, so I just love being around people and interacting with people. So I'm really excited to meet everyone and spend time with people and m like mostly like working with God and with people and bringing people to know God more and um, the family and the relationships and yeah, I'm just really excited um, to be with people. <laughs> Brilliant. That's, that's really cool. This is a really important question I'm going to ask you now. Okay. You ready? Bad. I love football. What team do you support? Awkward one. I don't, I don't really like football. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but there are some football teams near me. There's okay. um, Warsaw with, with our own team. Uh, West Bromwich Albion, Aston Villa. Birmingham City, Wolverhampton, loads of them. Okay, that's really fortunate that you come down to Alton there because they're all pretty rubbish, but there we go, never mind. Upper <laughs> <laughs> uh, Reading, is that right? Reading, Reading, yeah, Reading's a good team, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Top, of the, top of the championship at the moment. But, uh, oh, yeah, I'll keep that Sorry, forgive me, forgive me for my... Uh, <laughs> Andrew, ask a sensible question again, please. <laughs> so, Martha, I'd really like to know, what's your number one priority for young people in our parish? I think um, just enabling young people to connect with God and to see how he can help them in their lives no matter what's going on. I think for me as a teenager to um, realise that there is something bigger out there, there's someone bigger that loves me um, more than I could even understand is so important. So to bring that to the young people in autumn, whether they know him now or whether they don't know him at all, we're going to help him help them along that journey. Um, that's what I'm really excited about. Brilliant. We're so looking forward to having you around and being part of the team. And I know that you're going to be moving into Alton very, very soon. Yeah. And you, 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 people will be able to see you around town. And now they'll even know who to look for because they've seen you and they've heard a little bit about you. And I think what's really key in what we've heard from Martha is about God's love. And God's love is boundless and it crosses all generations. God's interested in the newborn baby interested the oldest person in the world and everyone in between so martha we're really looking forward to how you're going to help us to show and people can know god's love for them it's brilliant to welcome you gordon have you got anything else to say I've got one final question and this is really important okay have you got any party tricks <laughs> um i do have a little party trick 
I have string attached to my mouth. Oh, And and this this eyebrow as well. Wow! Well, wow! Have you got a string attached to Gordon? <laughs> Gordon, Gordon hasn't got one of those. No, I haven't. I haven't got any hair anyway. So I mean, it's just <laughs> <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. So shall you know? That's a little introduction. Shall we pray together? And yes. uh, please, at home, would you join in with this prayer? Heavenly Father, we thank you that the way that you bring people. Uh, to our parish and to our town, people that we know are going to um, inspire us and give us confidence. And we really now pray for Martha as she takes on this very important role, that you would bless her and give her all the wisdom and discernment she needs and give her all the graces and gifts of your Holy Spirit as she reaches out and walks and talks to you with our young people. We pray for our young people. Uh, at the Alton College, at Amory and Eggers, and in all the other different schools, and in the places where they gather. And we pray also for the King's Arms Project, and we pray for the partnerships that we have with these places. We thank you that Martha's coming to help us to bring all this together and to give us a new vision and a new strategy guided by you, O Lord our God. We thank you and we praise you and we bless you as you know you bless us. In the name of Jesus, amen. 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 So thank you for tuning in to our midweek encouragement. I hope it's really encouraged you, and one of us will see you next week. Take care of yourselves.